we have had very useful and important discussions in these two days about um, uh, partnerships in research and a lot of the recommendations have been given. Mutual learning should be deliberate right from the beginning of the partnership and issues such as publication should be discussed early enough. And another area is financing which is crucial for research. In financing we discuss about how to reduce uh, inequities and there are three ways, at least three important ways that we can do that. The first is to recognize the resources, but also the capacity of South partners. The, se the second is to um, engage the government because also we think thirdly that it is important um, to reduce dependence of South partners to the North. Under authorship, we discussed that researchers should be able to publish in open access journals to enable access for the South researchers. But we also discussed about um, research agenda, the setting of research agenda, and it is critically important that both South and North partners start discussions about research agenda from the beginning of uh, their partnership. For me personally, these two days have been so important and so beneficial. And I hope that we'll continue with such meetings in the future. And you? Um, I fully agree. And uh, the two days have made me think a lot as a South uh, researcher, I need to make contribution to knowledge while also um, ensuring that the partnership remains equal. The lopsided relationship between the global north and south needs to be restructured. Northern researchers need to make deliberate choices to cite southern journals if we want to change the narrative around what is a good journal. Capacity building is good but you need infrastructure to actualize the benefits of capacity building. Otherwise, you'll be training for people to leave the continent. <laughs>